Ah, uh, yes. Heavy metal. Overall, I want to say I was rather impressed with this movie. It is one of the uh, older cult classics. It came out in 1981 and featured a lot of really well-known artists at the time that were either like rock and roll or heavy metal, which is actually leading to the title of heavy metal. So this was based off of a magazine with the same name. However, in France, it was called Metal Herlant. Now, there is also a series called Metal Herlant, which I will check out sometime. But this time, it's heavy metal. The king of adult animation. This one, I'd rather say, is not for the weak. There is nudity, tons of nudity. And there is also some pretty violent things in it, so it's definitely not for kids. So, other than that, let's go on with the story. The story follows the Wachna, or the sum of all evil. Just causing all evil, I guess. That's all I could really say. And unlike Heavy Metal 2000, its sequel, this one is an anthology, which, if you don't like some segments of it, at least you'll like maybe one or two of it. My favorite, of course, was Tarna. Uh, it follows the main character Tarna, which is the same as the title, and she is a Terrakian, a really fucking overpowered warrior, and she's the last of her kind. She's summoned by uh, her civilians that were killed by a mob that was in Corrupted by the Loch Nahr. I I don't know, I'll have to watch that segment over again. It's fading in my mind, so basically it's the best part of the entire movie. You could just watch that part and leave rest. The soundtrack though, kick ass. I'd like to say that. If you're a fan of heavy metal or like the eight eighties metal and rock and roll. You're going to love this score. I mean, it's got Journey, it's got Don Felder, it's got um, Black Sabbath, it's even got um, Sammy Hagar, and all, all sorts of good artists from that time. So the score definitely is uh, it's really, really nice. So overall, I personally rate this a 4.5 out of 5. I was really impressed with this movie. The sequel I also enjoyed, however it's not as good as this one, but it's definitely worth the title Heavy Metal in my opinion. Anyway, so this is my review of Heavy Metal, thank you for watching, please subscribe below, and I'll see you next review.